Hey, how's it going everyone? Just back in with another uh, sequence video. This was in Revelation 19. And so, um, you know, just going through this, it looks like, you know, it's in every single chapter, pretty much. So this is incredible. Um, this wasn't as, this one is a little bit encoded, but Revelation 19, 1, it says salvation in verse 1. Then in verse 2, it says great whore, which is talking about America in the last days. And so um, it being destroyed. And then in verse 6, it says the great multitude, okay, which is the group that's being sifted during the time of the great tribulation. So we have salvation. We have a reference to great multitude. We have a reference to great whore, which is America being destroyed. And then we have references to Christ returning with his elect. <clears throat> verse 8, and to her was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen, clean and white, for the fine linen is the righteousness of the saints. And so after that time, now we have <clears throat> a reference right away to the saints. And then we have a reference to Christ destroying. And so I don't want to read all this, but, you know, I would just recommend people, you know, read it from Revelation 19, 10, all the way to the end. And so it talks about, um, you know, Christ destroying. Verse 19, And I saw the beasts and the kings of the earth and their armies gathered together to make war against him that sat on the horse and against his army. And the beast was taken. And so this beast represents God's entire left-hand side. And with him, the false prophet that wrought miracles before him, which with which he deceived them that had received the mark of the beast and then that worshiped the image. These both were cast alive into a lake of fire burning with brimstone. And the remnant were slain, were slain with the sword of him that sat upon the horse, which sword proceeded out of his mouth and all the fowls were filled with their flesh. So it's just mass killing. And this um, is also consistent with Second Ezra, of course, where um, Christ is going to be destroying by the labor of the law, which is like unto him. And so um, so he's able to just say it, you know, and then he wants to see the killing happening right before him, like in the book of Luke. And so this is the, the final wrath of God with um, the saints as refer reference in verse eight. So we have salvation, you know, the great multitude, the great whore being judged. And then we have Christ returning with his elect for this final battle at Armageddon. Hope everyone's doing well. Bye.